Republicans have razor thin majorities in both chambers of the Arizona legislature, but this year Democrats think they can win control. We're going to have a new legislature in January. So talk to an Arizona Democrat about November and they'll tell you they expect to flip the legislature. Well, we're going to win. <laughs> we're going to win. Republicans will say not so fast. But now the National Democratic Party is investing big money in eight legislative districts. Delivering Democratic majorities in Arizona is paramount, as Arizona Republicans are some of the most extreme in the country. Heather Williams is president of the Democratic Legislative Campaign Committee. From abortion to immigration to elections, she sees Arizona as a key state with big issues on the table. Democrats' message to voters is, let's get to work on common sense solutions. The people that I'm talking to at doors um, share that universal disgust with uh, politicians just screaming at each other and not getting anything done. And they're hoping to appeal to more than just Democrats. We're talking to Democrats, we're talking to independents, we're talking to Republicans. Republican strategist Stan Barnes says focusing on voters in the middle is key in Arizona. Our Democratic friends are having a good run because they are putting up good candidates that do well in general elections. However, he's predicting some GOP pickups in the House and an evenly split state Senate. It's the conventional wisdom uh, in capital crowd that it's going to be a 15-15 tie. But he also says anything can happen in November, especially in our swing districts. And we might get a 15-15 Senate and a 30-30 House, which has never happened in state history. For ABC 15's political team, I'm manually to Beck.